It's about freedom. What's going on you guys? It's the coach and commentator here, Dreon Santana, checking in for Hip Hop Weekly for the 2020 BET Hip Hop Awards Press Conference. Due to COVID-19 safety issues, the BET Hip Hop Awards press conference was held virtually over Zoom, and we had the opportunity to speak with presenters, honorees, and performers. Let's check in with the King of the South, T.I. What's happening? What's going on? How you doing? Chill it, man. I'm fucking with the hell. Thank you. Thank you. Took a long time I'm to do it. Santana over here at Hip Hop Weekly. It's an honor to be speaking with you for the very, very first time. Like, I love your music, been a big fan for a very, very long time. So let's go ahead and jump right in. So you are a legend in the industry. Everyone okay. will literally stop and listen to you speak. With everything that has been going on surrounding around 2020, from the loss of Kobe to the killing of George Floyd to the verdict of Breonna Taylor, so now everything is going on over in Nigeria. Mm. What encouraging words would you give to those who have who are losing their family, losing their friends, even injured, or even going through emotional trauma at this time? Uh, I would urge I would urge you to be quiet and still listen to the voice inside of you. You know what I'm saying? You have you, you, you can't be moved by the noise of the outside world. You gotta kinda like get to a more centered space and 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 trust the process of the universe. You dig what I'm saying? Um it's a tumultuous time. Uh and, and but I, I think we gotta trust we gotta trust in, in in purpose. And the earth has a purpose. There's a time and a place for everything. I think we're we're in the midst of an evolution, uh, an evolution and a revolution. You know what I mean? I feel like if you look back, man, in, in the history of humanity, uh, empires have fallen because they fought against change. You know what I mean? From the Romans to the Egyptians, you know, the Mayans. You dig what I'm saying? Everyone that fought against change change is inevitable life is nothing but a series of adjustments you know what i mean that's collectively and individually you know we we born and we begin to adjust and when we stop adjusting we start dying so all this stuff is all this stuff that we're experiencing from even you know even the the atrocities that are happening in nigeria with sars uh which which my heart and, and all of my, my thoughts go out to them. But all of the stuff to the white supremacy shit that you see here, all of this shit, man, is, is, is negative energy, basically. And mm -hmm. the universe will rid itself of the negative energy. Negative energy always cancels itself out. That shit always find a way to throw itself in the trash. So all we have to do is kind of just show up every day that we're alive and apply more faith and fear uh, and, and let that guide our footsteps, man. I think, you know what I'm saying, it's gonna work itself up.